and now let's try to run this particular code on the simulator and try to see how this particular animation works and this is a very quick way of implementing the live animation on our flutter application box fit dot fill doesn't suit well here so let's try to make it a cover and let's try to find yes this looks fine on the application in this log we are going to deal with the implementation of live animations in our flutter application so in our previous tutorial we have seen the implementation of animation using lottie and here is the link for the tutorial and if you have not gone through that particular tutorial i suggest you to watch that particular tutorial and get started with the animation and how we implemented animation in our flutter application and also there we tried creating an animation by customizing the existing ones so for detailed implementation i suggest you to go through that particular tutorial and in this part of the tutorial we are going to implement animations using rive dependency and here and here this is the official website of the rive animation and it not only supports flutter but there are multiple platforms here and the same case with the lottie animation as well and here you can see that these are the companies which are currently making use of this particular rive animation and there are few more companies but they have mentioned top companies over here and also what i observed here is like making use of rive animation we can also create widgets here like a customized widgets here you can see like graphs we can find on the screen here and this particular animation is for gaming and whenever you try to create some interactive games then you can make use of these particular animations and you can customize them even according to your requirement and also you can find here the animated menus here and whenever you are trying to create an application such that there exists a lot of animation in it for example like a games or any other application where your main criteria is in terms of look of the application then i suggest you to get started with this particular rive animation implement these particular widgets on your flutter application so as we are dealing with this flutter apps so we are trying to implement them in uh, mobile applications but if you have a requirement then you can also implement them in websites and desktop based applications as well and i suggest you to stay tuned till the end of this particular tutorial don't skip any part of the tutorial so now while it let's get started with this particular tutorial so here i have added the rive dependency here and now let's get started with this particular code now and import material dot dart so this is the basic import which we do for every application and here let's try to see do we have any drive so yes we have like rive dot dart here and as i said earlier you can also add this particular animations to the website and here we do have also a dependency for rive underscore web so if you are interested in coming tutorial we'll also try to implement an animation in web page as well so for now let's get started with the mobile application and void main and as we do for every tutorial we are getting started with the basics here and if you are well aware of this particular basics i suggest you to just skip to the main part of the tutorial and here i am just making use of a stateless widget because the main aim of this particular application is to just display an animation onto the screen and here we are returning a material app over here instead of a placeholder or any other widget here and inside the material app we specify scaffold and for this particular application i just don't want to have any app bar i'm i'm skipping the app bar here and here in the body section let's try to make use of this particular rive animation here so let's make use of rive animation and here we have like four options the first thing is like network second asset third direct and fourth one is file so let's try to make use of network here and try to make use of a url which ends with dot riv which states like rive animation file here so here i am making use of this particular url here and here we got this particular animation file and now let's try to specify the fit box fit here we'll try to fit it to the entire screen and also you can just make it a constant here 
and even this one if we make constant and now let's try to run this particular code on the simulator and try to see how this particular animation works and this is a very quick way of implementing the live animation on our flutter application and here we can find this particular animation now box fit dot fill doesn't suit well here so let's try to make it a cover and let's try to find yes this looks fine on the application and the other one i think it's best suited for a web page and now let's try to implement with an asset here so for making with an asset we require an asset file and you can just remove this particular url and now get started with the folder creation so here let's try to create a folder assets here under the root folder like flutter anim is my project name and here let's try to create a folder like animations and now here let's try to uncomment here and here instead of images here let's try to specify assets and forward slash animations so we can add the animations to this particular folder and forward slash here so this is the animation file which i got here and we cannot open this particular animation file here this can be opened only from the live animation dependency here now let's try to specify this particular live animation file like rating underscore animation dot rev and also we need to specify the path as well assets forward slash animations forward slash and now let's try to stop and try to rerun the code again and here we can see the output now and we have got the ratings here so just try to uh, i mean in portrait mode we are not able to find this particular rating animation but in landscape mode we are able to find it so the problem here is like box fit not cover here we can make use of fill now in our previous animation it was an issue but now let's try to make use of fill animation and yes this works fine but here it's a little bit stretched and in our coming tutorial let us try to customize this particular animation file and try to uh, add that particular animation file which we have created in rive editor and also we thought of like implementing an animation in web page like for a website and also we'll try to create an animation so in coming tutorials we'll deal with these two topics just let me know in the comment section below if you are interested in this particular topics and also i am providing you the links for the lotty dependence lotty based uh, flutter animations as well in the description section below so this is it for this particular tutorial so the code for this tutorial is available in the description section below and if you are having any queries in this particular implementation just let me know in the comment section below so if you like this tutorial do like share and subscribe to our channel for more interesting content on flutter